Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini National Treasures Baseball. Four box, pick your team number 40. I'm a man, I'm 40. A lot of great stuff in here. Big thanks to all of these wonderful people. Where's the list? For getting into the action. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There are some RNBs, random number blocks. We did that randomizer, it's in a separate video. Here are the results, right there. Yo. Can I have two of your fillers? Yeah. That works. There's that group right here. There's the teams. There are the numbers. Everyone knows how this works, right? We'll keep that all the way over here. All right, and here is the full case of NT Baseball. All right, good luck. Nelson, what's going on? these back here. First box right off the top. Good luck. We got a redemption on the bottom. Here is a blank card right here to slow play some of the hits a little bit. All right, good luck. Here we go. Love this stuff. Let's get some monsters. 86 out of 99. Poor Alex Kirlov. I think he. Wait, was it he? Did he do his? No, it was his teammate Royce Lewis who did his ACL, right? I think Kirilov has been maybe battling some injuries too. Anyway, this goes to the Twins. That's going to be for Hovsep. Next one is the Wizard, Ozzy Smith, 17 out of 25, St. Louis. That is going to be, St. Louis is a number block team. And so St. Louis 7 is going to be for Chris Miller. There you go, Chris. Colossal, Kyle Schorber, 56 out of 99. Got the Cubs pinstripe in there. Going to Michael and the Cubbies. We got Luis Tiant, 23 out of 25. Old California Angel. Going to Chris Phelps and the Halos. California, Los Angeles, Anaheim Angels of Anaheim. Nice patch, nice auto. Jake Fraley, 23 out of 99. Mariners, Shane with the M's. And we've got Andres Munoz, jersey and autograph, 33 out of 99 for the Padres. Chris Miller has the Friars. And we've got uh, Aristides Aquino. Nice. 20 out of 49 for Cincinnati. Great patch in there, Jeff. I didn't notice it until this recently, but he, he does, those three dots right here, he always does that. That's part of his, I guess he's signs. Dot, dot, dot. And we've got, ooh, nice Luis Tiant again. This time Boston edition. A Luis Tiant box, 53 out of 99. Going to Michael and the Bo Sox. And the redemp is gonna be cut signature stat line booklets, card 32. No worries, Jeff. It's gonna be P, I said Pedro, E, D, 
R.O. Martinez? Pedro Martinez. Um, let's see what is the edition of Pedro Martinez this is going to be. Uh, let's go to groupbreakchecklist.com. I'm thinking Boston, but it could be Montreal. could even be Los Angeles Dodgers. 2020 NT. Groupbreakchecklist.com, baseball section, NT. Yeah, that seems kind of odd, right? It's a redemption for a cut signature. All right, so Pedro Mar, he has a couple. No, that's just, that's Hall of Fame signatures. That's Midnight Signature, that's a relic. That's a relic, that's a relic. So this is Montreal edition. Yeah, I'm not sure why that, that that's a very good point, Adam Coverman. Why would that be? It's just a, I mean, they're just cutting out an autograph from somewhere. Maybe whatever source they're getting the cut from was delayed. That's the only thing I can think of. Uh, Montreal Expos, of course, Nationals. That'll go to Quinton and Mark Cuddy. That's the only thing I can think of, is that wherever they're sourcing that particular cut was delayed for some reason, and now now Quentin has to go through this whole rigmarole. But there you go. Still nice, though. Pedro Martinez is great. All right. That was box one. Here's the next box. Yeah, that, exactly. HP. That, that's all I can think of. It's like... It was just delayed getting to the to the factory that's producing these cards. And... All right. Good luck. Another book on the bottom. So it's gonna. It's a dual something. I saw a couple players' names on there. All right, 41 out of 989, A.J. Puck. Michael with the A's, Puck it. Next up, Jorge Soler, 36 out of 99 for the Royals. Hope set. With the Royals. Max Scherzer, 8 out of 25. Nice Scherzer relic going to Quinton. That Hall of Fame, a relic. That's Roberto Clemente. Nice. 19 out of 21, a piece of his lumber going to Jeff. A little bit of history there, Jeffrey. And a nice Kyle Lewis rookie auto, 97 out of 99 for the Mariners. Shane White with the M's. Brian saying five left in that flawless, plus the filler, Brian. But, yeah, we are pretty close on that. All right, next we've got 17 out of 25. Nice dual relic and autograph, Davey Grillon. For the Phillies, Brandon Richards with the fight and fills. Ooh, that's part of the, uh, this is for the A's, that's part of the, the baseball where the elephant stands, I think. 24 out of 25. Nice Sean Murphy patch and autograph. It's a strong one. Another A for Michael. Jersey and auto, 
Two color patch and auto. Casey Mize. 14 out of 25. He's going to have a full season this year. Hopefully a good one. Former number one overall pick. That would be hashtag good for the hobby. Tigers. Tyler Brenner. Tyler was saying he got Casey Mize's in Inception too. So he's got a nice little, nice little Mize collection going from us. All right. Dual material. Jordan. Jordan Alvarez and Bo Bichette. Dual Signature materials. Wow, 97 out of 99. Both on book. Pretty nice stuff. Astros, Hofsepp, and Toronto Blue Jays, Demetrios. There you go. A different Demetrios. Demetrios V. All right, so we'll, we'll randomize that at the end. Along with anything else. All right, halfway there, two to go. All right, kind of fatter and sort of lopsided. Button maybe? It's kind of weird. Ooh. Tyler Brenner, you called it. Or who called it? Someone said Bat Knob, right? Or is it Robert? Who called Bat Knob earlier? Tyler Brenner says, let's see a Bat Knob in this case. There it is. What are we going to do with this? We're going to set this back there. There you go. Yeah, it was Tyler. Nice. It's an old school guy, too. Alex Gordon, 14 out of 25. Alex Gordon, Kansas City, Hofsepp. We got Ronald Acuna Jr., 7 out of 99. Shane with the Braves. Ken Griffey Jr., 99 out of 99. Uh, that's Mariner's edition. Going to Shane and Seattle. We've got Jake Cave, 93 out of 99 for Minnesota. we got one for the Blue Jays, Anthony K, 30 out of 49. Some nice lettering right there. I always thought the white stripe through the letters and the numbers in the Blue Jays uniform always looked really cool. We've got Punisher, Aristides Aquino. 34 out of 49. You can definitely punish the ball. Jeffrey with the Reds, another Aquino autograph. Ooh, nice Stars and Stripes autograph. Anthony Rizzo. That is 7 out of 10 on that one. Michael with the Cubbies. And Sean Murphy is your... Oh, nice patch. He's your patch and book. Nice. Michael with the A's. 10 out of 10. Nice low number there. Yeah, Punisher Prime, you should get that Punisher card. Add that to your collection. All right, the Bat Knob. I don't know if, if we did a Who Am I, would you, would you even know? This guy's heyday was in the... was in the 1940s through 50s. Early 60s. 1948 to 1962 is how far his career spanned. Played for three teams his entire career. Um, has a lifetime 308 batting average. Has 2,574 hits. Just 29 home runs, but 586 runs batted in. He is uh, in the Hall of Fame, inducted by the Veterans Committee in the mid-90s, 1995. 
He was a six-time All-Star and a two-time NL batting champion and a stolen base leader. Any guesses, old school guy? Played for the last, so I'm gonna go, the team he's on is the first team he played for. That's the team on here. But he ended his career with the Mets in 1962, played with the Cubs from 1960 to 61, and then played for this team my entire career from 1948 to 1959. So put on your old school guys. It's not Hank Greenberg. I think Hank Greenberg had, had a lot of home runs. This guy only had 29. More of a speedy dude. What? He's not with us anymore. He passed away in the late 90s, 1997 at the age of 70. He's one of the most beloved figures in sport, Philadelphia sports history. So it's going to go to the Phillies. Brandon Richards. And what else? I think he did some broadcasting for the Phillies for a while too. I think maybe, maybe most of you these days may know him as a broadcaster. The one-of-one one bat knob is old Richie Ashburn. How cool is that? That is awesome. And that goes to Brandon Richards and the Philadelphia Phillies. I actually think this doesn't go into a... This might be easier to put this into a slider box here. There you go. Nice Richie Ashburn. There's like a little mark in there. Nice bat knobs. That's pretty awesome. Brandon. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. That is pretty, pretty sweet. All right. Final box. Let's see what we got. There you go. There's Brandon. Your first one of one pull is a nice, nice old school Philly Hall of Famer, Richie Ashburn. He's one of those guys that bats left and throws right. Hey Mike, Richie Ashburn bat knob. Yeah. Old Phil, yeah, beloved in Philadelphia. All right, final box. Good luck. Hey, you're welcome, Brandon. Thanks for getting in. You can't win if you don't play. Appreciate you getting your team straight up. Worked out nicely. There's Joe Adele. For the Angels out of 25, that's going to go to Chris Phelps. We've got Colossal Relic, uh, Maurizio Dubon to 99. Rookie Relic, one of the uh, Giants' top prospect, Chris Parent with that one. We've got Vlad Guerrero Jr., 82 out of 99. Lean and mean Vlad Guerrero Jr. nowadays. That goes to Demetrius V and the Blue Jays. There's Joe Torre, 29 out of 99, Hall of Fame relic. Bit of the Yankee pinstripe in there. And that's a number block team, actually. Yankees 9 is going to go to Brian Crouch with the Yankees 9. We got deep in the heart of Texas. That's a cool looking card here. Nick Solak, 75 out of 99. I actually don't know that song. Deep, deep in the heart of Texas. Um, I know the song exists. I just don't know it. Jarrett with the Rangers in that one. 73 out of 99, Bobby Bradley. Cleveland, this is for you. 
Kenny G says, I'm one of those guys that bats left and throws right, but he doesn't have Richie Ashburn speed. Does not have Richie Ashburn power. Oh, he only hit one home run in your career. You do have Richie Ashburn power, though. I did, Cooper. There's a uh, Ronald Bolanos, 26 out of 49. In fact, I don't know if you're in the, our Facebook group, Cooper, but if you go to our Facebook group and click the discussion tab, there is a Jaspies group. Uh, tournament group on ESPN. Mostly for bragging rights. Alright, so there you go, San Diego. That'll be for Chris Miller. We've got a redemption. Let's show the jumbo first. 8 out of 25, legendary materials booklet. Old Joe Cronin for the Boston Red Sox. Teddy, what's your what's your favorite Joe Cronin memory? <laughs> this is this is way 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 before before our times all right and there's a redemption back here boston that'll be for uh for michael with the red Sox. hugh cronin only had one eye that's wild midnight signatures do 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 is f frank Francisco, Fernando, Fernando Valenzuela, Tatis, Tatis, look at that, Midnight Signatures, Fernando Tatis Jr. for Chris Miller and the San Diego Padres. That's pretty sharp right there, there you go, nice way to end this break. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen, great bat knob, a lot of excellent autographs, a lot of fun stuff. A randomizer to do one person happy, one person sad. So, just one randomizer to do. Right, yeah, we're good here. So let's flip back to some new dice. And a new list. So that's Jordan Alvarez, Houston, and Bo Bichette, Toronto. Name on top. After six. Good luck. Six the hard way. One. Two. Three, four, five, and six. Houston with that one. And that will be for Hovsep. Sad times for the Blue Jays, but happy times for the Astros. There you have it. And there you go. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. We'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.